someone talking. Mr. Perkins, would you call out your two numbers? Please. I'll call out um, 34 and uh, 88. Uh, and by the way, would uh, all you people here in the studio please insert a, a message or something that you've written down or something you've got with you uh, into the numbered envelopes which were handed to you when you first arrived this evening. Uh, uh, Miss Young, <laughs> would you read out uh, what is written down on the piece of paper that you hold? Okay, put the top back on. Okay, well, I'll just uh, find out from Gilbert Harding whether he's got any message. Good heavens, there's money in one of those things. Not long now, Mr. Pinson. Anyway, they've been the put up. The cue is, you, you'll hear that I make the cue quite clear. You'd rather be sitting down, Leslie, wouldn't you? I think Sydney and uh, the rest are yours. Now, uh, a, a, a that appears to be a, a very fine collection. Uh, uh, right now, uh, uh, I'm going to uh, take you to the cruiser. Will you get Mrs. Bissington? Um, food? Something about food. It's a... Uh, a ration book. It's something like a ration book. Just one piece of... It's an emergency card. Some of the things have been cut out. If you concentrate on... on the rations that have been left in, I'll try and get them. Milk. Eggs. Cheese. Uh, meat. The other was the pound note, and I really must meet this is Piddington. <laughs> I think uh, two were... were uh, uh, not quite correct, not quite. Right, Gilbert Harding and Bristol, come in, will you? Hello. We're still here, Stephen Grenfell and Sidney Piddington, and uh, Leslie is still completely isolated. She's looking a little bit uh, exhausted after the last effort. We'll be ready for you again under the, exactly the same conditions. Uh, so thank, thank you, you Gilbert Harding. Right. Uh, now, Miss Young, uh, will you and uh, Mr. Williams come over uh, to this microphone here? Will you? will you stand by, Mrs. Pennington, again, please? We're ready for you. All right. Uh, a bird. One bird. Hail to thee, blithe spirit, bird thou never wert. <laughs> All right, concentrate again, won't you, Sydney? words this time. It's a drawing. A pattern. Draft board. Something it can't be. It's on paper. Or oh, someone's given a, a crossword puzzle. It's only... It's half filled in. They haven't got all the words. You want me to give the words there are? Right, concentrate on the first one, will you? Uh, a listening audience and also for our, our studio audience, explain what it is, and...
and what the words were, I think, uh, uh, Leslie was completely wrong in one, a word here which I can't read or understand myself, but if you'd explain it, please. Well, ladies and gentlemen, <coughs> I take rather longer doing my uh, crossword uh, puzzles, but the first word was shuffle and cut, and curtain was right, Second and right was right. The third one was right. Uh, the word that Mrs. Pittington said was uh, head, was in point of fact cranium. When you said head, it was in fact cranium. Make head or tail off is a word. And by landline from Bristol to London, are you happy, Leslie? Yes, thank you, I am. Anything to say? Well, only thanks very much, everyone, and you're the judge. Uh, well, I think we were, well, well, all right, and I'm baffled. Now back to City Piddington and Piccadilly. Uh, I have 